What's going on upcyclers? Back with a quick one for you today. I got a really good deal on this box and it's been sitting on my desk for ooh, a couple of months now and since the Masters is going on right now I thought it would be a good time to open it. What we have here is a product by Grand Slam Ventures. They did a set called Champions of Golf um, with a card, a card for each winner of the Masters for the whole uh, history of the Masters up and through 1997 when this was made, which coincidentally, or not so coincidentally, was when Tiger, won's, Tiger Woods won his first major. That being said, a lot of people do consider the 2001 Upper Deck Golf Tiger Woods' rookie card, but this predates that card by about three and a half years, but it's also not from a major company and they weren't really sold in packs. You'll see when we open this, I've never opened one of these before, but I did a little bit of research and apparently all this is is just a set. So it's gonna be like one box and I think that there's a lot of condition problems with the Tiger card because they put them in the pack or in the, um, in the cellophane in order. So Tiger is either on the top or the bottom and it tends to not be in great shape. So even like PSA six examples of this card sell for, you know, a hundred bucks and up. And I barely paid a hundred bucks for the box. So I'm hoping that we get lucky and the card is in decent shape. Odds are I'm just gonna add it to my PC anyway. So uh, yeah, I guess without further ado, let's get in here. Now I know there's also allegedly an issue with these as a lot of cards made around this time period had, which was it had issues with uh, bricking and sticking together. Yep, okay, there's the Tiger card on the back, I expected it to be. Now we are going to get surgical. Sorry, it's hard to focus on what I'm doing here and talk at the same time. All right, new tool. Now we're in focus. Focus. I think I can slip this in here just enough. Again, because I'm not really, I know I'm not touching the tiger card, right? Okay. Got that sorted out. question is, are we going to have a big old brick or are they just going to nicely come apart like they're supposed to? You know, not bad. I mean, it is slightly stuck. Edge is definitely not great. All right, so if this is the 97, then 96 is right in front of him. All right, don't, before I show it, put in the comments below, don't cheat and look it up on Google. Who won the Masters in 1996, the year before Tiger, i.e. who was the one that put the jacket on Tiger? I 
don't remember. I want to say, I want to say Olathobel, but I think he was the year after, like 98 or 99. Was 96, was it Crenshaw? Or was Crenshaw 95? Any event? Nick Faldo. Crenshaw was 95. I was right about that. Bernard Longer. Bernard Longer. I don't know if that sound, sound is coming through on the video or not, but these are crusty and stuck together. But again, the main event is right here. I mean, with the sticking together issues and all the black on this, this was destined to be a tough one to get a decent grade on. Or I guess to say to pull an example that would get a decent grade. This one doesn't even look gradable to me. It is pretty jacked up. Let's see if any of this, see if any off. The old tried and true. Breathe on it, get a little hot air steam going. Give her a good wipe. Nope. Got a fat scratch right there. Pretty sure I didn't do that. Well, it's definitely an interesting card. But for many people, that is the true Tiger Woods rookie card right there. And this one's not looking too great. Anyway. Um, I've got lots of other videos, so if you enjoy this kind of content and want to support me in the channel, I'd really appreciate it. Um, if you could subscribe, subscribe, like the video, throw any comments you have down below, and um, yeah, check out my uh, other videos. And uh, I hope you have a great day. Take care. Thank you.